today, the host at the southwest corner of Queen Street and Cresswell Drive is in disrepair. But there was a time when it was one of Trenton's most elegant mansions. Even today, the bay windows, balcony, and unique entrance are reminders of its once glorious past. Its owners were Captain Jonathan Port and his wife, Phoebe Garnet Port. Captain Port was born in Ireland. He was captain of a steamer, Varuna, which made daily trips between Trenton and Picton. The other ships he owned were the Mary Ethel and the Utica. Jonathan Port died March 1, 1893. Trenton's Harbor was a beehive of activity in the early 1900s. Day and night, barges and schooners loaded and unloaded lumber, grain and other supplies. Excursion boats such as the Varuna and the Brockville were a favorite for Trentonians going on picnics to 12 o'clock point, Presqu'ile or the Thousand Islands. These boats also brought visitors into Trenton for shopping at the numerous stores and daily market or entertainment at Purdy's or O'Rourke's Opera Houses. Steamers capable of carrying several hundred passengers plus freight called Trenton their home port, while others visited regularly. These included the Utica, leaving Trenton daily at 6 a.m. for all bay ports. The Alexandria, wrecked in a storm in 1915, traveled to Montreal every Monday, while the Caspian made daily trips between Trenton and Rochester, New York. Another fascinating story of Trenton's past.